Okay, so with Ringwalk Media, it's Media Day press conference down at uh, Manchester with the Chris Eubank and uh, Liam Smith fight. And we've managed to come across Super Mario Silva. How are you, mate? I'm good, thank you. How are you, yourself? I'm all right. And you've, uh, you've done some good things and uh, just got signed by Chris Eubank. Yeah, it's, it's a pleasure to be signed by him. Now the sky's the limit, going to build up my career and show what I said I was going to show to you before, class. Yeah, you did tell me that a little while ago, and you had a go at me over Christmas for not putting me on the, put, putting you on your list. You know what it was? I seen it. I thought, you know what? It's fine, but I'm gonna make you regret the fact that you didn't put me on. But now I'm gonna show all my actions. Listen, that was just to spur you on. That's what it was. That was my game plan. Listen, listen. Um, you've also signed a five-fight deal with uh, Black Flash Promotions, Pat Barrett. That's a cracking platform for you to get out and show showcase your skills. Nah, I'm very excited and very, very fortunate to have Pat sign me for these five fights and they're all going to be located very locally so I've got a big fan base and big people coming to my fight now so better turn up now guys you're going to enjoy the show uh, listen you know are you, are you going to be carrying on training with uh, with Pat or is uh, you going to nip down and see Chris a few times um, I'm training with Paulie obviously my dad yeah and odd times we do some sparring with Pat Barrett's fighters and I will be going often down to Chris Eubank Jr's gym and training with him and Roy and that experience training with Roy Jones Jr. and Chris must be amazing. You know what it is? These guys have analysed the game and realised it's more than just boxing. It's a game of chess. It's all about thinking, strategies, battles, decisions. They've, they've figured it out. And to just be around them and listen to what they say, not even how they act, just what they say. You can learn a lot from it. And I've learned a lot so far from being down there. It's an exciting time for you and uh, it's a cracking move. I must say, uh, when I saw that, I was really excited for you. Nah, I'm really excited as well. Obviously, dream come true. Alhamdulillah, praise be to Allah for everything that happens to me. And God's got some great plan for me, so let's just enjoy the journey. I think Pat's got a good plan for you as well because he's you're out on the 18th of February, aren't you? 18th of February at Bowlers Arena. And can people get tickets off you now? People can get tickets from me now. VIPs are all sold out, but I've still got my ring sides and standards ready. And Mr Eubank going to come and watch? Hopefully. Who knows? Inshallah. Well, listen, we can't let you go without talking about the Lyndon and Sonny show. It's kind of taken the, the Instagram by storm. I got myself into trouble on it this week. Um, I mean, it's a good fun. It's cracking, isn't it? And you were on it. You know what? It's all a good laugh. And then, obviously, people can call out whoever they want to call out. But then when they don't turn up to sparring sessions or don't turn up when they're supposed to, uh, not going to say no names, especially about Harley Ben. When you don't turn up, it just shows that you don't want it. And they don't want this smoke. And they, and they will keep avoiding as long as they want. But you know what? That just shows where we're at. And it's all jokes like Monday Madness, Toxic Tuesday. It's all jokes. Well, listen, I've got to back up my man, Harley, because he had a rough rough ride this week. And uh, I'm back in the boy now. He's, he's got, we've got to lay off Harley for a little while. You know what it is? He does this to himself. You could say we can all lay off him or he's bullying. He's doing it to himself. When you're calling out big names and even MMA fighters and then when they're trying to stick it on you saying, yeah, let's get it done and don't get it done. That's all on you if you don't get it done. It just shows what type of man you are, to be honest. Well, listen, we, we have to stress this is just a bit of fun. It isn't real. and obviously nah, the... it, is, it is a bit of fun and it can get real if he wants it to get real. But till then, we'll just keep playing this little game. You fancy a bit of sparring with Ali? Nah, you know what? I don't fancy it. I know it should happen. <laughs> and I can put him in his place. He thinks he's this big thing because he's a Ben. But like we said, he's a B-Tech Ben. He's a very new road Ben. A fake copy. He's got nothing going for himself. Lost to a journeyman with 54 losses with his only win being Harley Ben. You know what big achievement that is to be at Harley Ben for your first fight? Come on. It just shows that there's levels to this game and you're not part of this, this spectrum. Well, strong words from Super Mario. You did tell me you were going to make a name for yourself and I should see. And I'm looking forward to the 18th of February. Good luck, mate. It's really good to see you and congratulations on both deals. Thank you very much.